So we got a call for an Apple Silicon Mac and the two USB-C ports are not working reliably. Dongles don't work, chargers don't work, Apple chargers don't work consistently. So what we did was we turned it off and we booted into the diagnostics menu by holding the power button at boot until it ran to boot options and then pressing command D and holding command D until we got into the diagnostics menu. And that's where we're here at here. We're agreeing to that. Of course, we've connected the device to the internet and now we're just waiting for a session. Now, because we're not actually gonna do a session with a Apple technician, we are the Apple technician. In this case, we're gonna run the diagnostics offline and see what they say. So this is one of those weird head scratcher problems where the ports look fine, the hardware looks fine, it's just not working as expected. So this is a good tool in the toolbox to try and understand the problem better. And so now diagnostics are running, they're checking the Mac, and with the power of editing, we will blow right through this faster than it will take when you run it on your own machine. Once the diagnostics are done, you're gonna get some codes. So make sure you have a camera ready on like your phone to take a picture of those codes. In this case, we can see the reference codes are Papa 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 020 and Papa 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 001. So we got those codes and now we can click get started for more information and look up what those codes are in the reference documentation. And so if you Google Apple diagnostic reference codes, you can pull them all up. Command F is your friend. So let's command F these codes. Maybe an issue with the power adapter. We are using the correct power adapter, so that's an indicator of a bigger problem. Okay, let's pop in that other code. And once again, we can see that there is no power adapter detected. So these ports got some weird issue going on. It's time to send this thing in for repair, unless you know how to repair it in-house, take it apart and try and figure out why those ports aren't working. In any case, that's all I got for you today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you around.